Go ahead. So then we're taking a look at, at the touchpad, which is Palm's new tablet. You may have heard about it. 9.7-inch uh, display, 1.2 gigahertz Qualcomm CPU, and obviously running WebOS. Uh, so do you want to just give yeah, a quick run Yeah, sure. Through um, so a couple of things that we did here. Uh, it's running the same WebOS, uh, very intuitive user interface. You can see it's got the familiar card interface, my photos, my uh, browser. Um, but we have tried to use the full canvas that we have now, the giant canvas, to really reimagine some of the applications. One of the ones that we have really done is the email. Uh, you see that on the left is all my Google, Palm, all my sources. I can go uh, jump into all the way into folders. This and is you, my email list. And you can use these little handles uh, there. And then I can use these little there. panes. You can see that this, this email I would really love to see in the full kind of uh, the display. It's a rich, full inline HTML email, and I can go enjoy that, focus on this, go back and forth, just just like you do um, uh, more of a desktop style uh, email browsing. Okay, and, and when, then you and can when, zoom out. And Sorry, when, go ahead. So when you want to jump back to cards, where's what's the gesture like you do? So, it? so the gesture we have done away with the gesture area on okay. this. We have this little button because we felt that people would be doing portraits and landscape. Right. On this so, so it's lot. always this button here. So there's always a center button that gets you back okay. all the way out. Uh, but let me just quickly show you one more thing in the email, um, and that really is uh, stacking of the emails, and uh, which is a new feature in uh, 2.0. Um, let's say I'm in this email, and I go click on that. You see how the browser open, but it's kind of stacked over it. So that's how you can actually visualize, organize your workspace. And you can space. throw these away just like and you can, can in regular yeah, WebOS. In, reg in regular WebOS, you can just throw that away like right. that. You can throw one away from top of the stack. Um, you want to compose a new email, I can start an email. I could get interrupted while trying to write up this email. I could go back. I could go back to my inbox. This is something that not even uh, the most productive-minded OSs do today, which is when you are in an email, let you go back and start another email. Right. So it is really powerful, kind of like the power of desktop email behavior. And you can you can change practice. the size of this keyboard. How do yes. you do that? Uh, you hold that. And oh, okay. one size doesn't fit all. Different sizes and here. You could go different sizes. Uh, so sorry, you went there. And then the other thing we want to talk about, which is really subtle um, and simplified, is the number row. This is a very familiar uh, keyboard, and by doing the number row, it pre prevents you from switching the context over and over again as right. you are typing. This is a very familiar um, keyboard. And then you have text correction, text assist. Uh, technology is to really help you start typing fast on it. Yeah. Oh, nice thing there. Yeah. yeah. So, but yeah. So. Okay, works just the way you'd expect. Yeah. So, so I want to see a couple of things. So the notifications. So the notification area is up here on the top, and you'll notice. Yeah. Sure. So that just drops down like that, and every time you get a new notification, it kind of slides over here. Uh, and then if I want to respond to this, so uh, yeah, it just pops it open. You can be here, and then um, not only that, you can actually go triage your notifications from here. And if I find, oh, I need to uh, go do this, you can tap on it, go right to the email. Right. The other thing that that this does is you see the SMSs come in here, uh, which is which is something that you might have seen inside as well. Right. Wait, one, um, one quick thing. Sure. I, I, I'm going to have to run, but you, you have, there's Skype on this, is that right? Are you uh, showing Skype? I'm not showing Skype today, but it does have a front-facing camera, and we will be doing the video call. And, and will there be Skype? Uh, we, you can't say. You're not allowed to say, are you? Right. You can just tell me that it'll be our secret. <laughs> yeah, so Skype will be available. Yeah, we, we heard the step up in the middle of the thing. Yeah. Yeah, we will. We are showing Skype on Pre3 today. The final oh, only on Pre3, but you think it'll maybe. The partnerships will, will evolve. I mean, they're still. Um, we are evolving that. Okay. But you can see that we would be doing video calling on these on these devices. Okay.